YouTube. Hey RVers, RV lady here. This is what I have been doing. This is to be my grandson's um, new room. And let's see, on Sunday, Saturday was the, her baby shower. And then Sunday, I put this map up on the wall because the theme for her um, nursery is, you know, the world. So I think she's got enough world stuff now. I took the ceiling fan down, need to put that back up. Same with all the covers on everything. And then, um, this is kind of a long funny story, but uh, when I was in Northern California, I bought this. And then this is going to be mounted over there somehow. And that will be, you know, enough of the travel thing. Now, interestingly enough, this beat up old furniture is my daughter's furniture for when she was a teenager. And I said, you know, let's go to the store buy whatever you want I don't care and so she bought this tremendously huge furniture which you know she's happy with she likes it so I'm down but this is going to serve as changing table you know storage storage etc now we had to paint this room uh, first I had to wash all the walls and paint this room. Now, here's why I had to wash the walls. Other than to get the walls in condition to, you know, accept the paint. This is what a lawn looks like in a drought. And basically this was all, you know, beautiful grass with beautiful plants along the fences with lights and the whole deal. And because we're in a drought in Southern California. There is, I mean, you basically make a choice between, do you want to take a shower or do you want to water your lawn? So this, because the gardener comes, why, I don't know, but because the gardener comes, he goes back here and like blows all the dirt all over the place. So when I got here, it was like every time I touched water to any surface, mud. So, not fun. But anyway, that's that. That's the, uh, the new carpet that they got throughout the house. For high traffic areas and whatnot, they ripped the carpet out some time ago and put in, uh, or just painted the concrete, which I really like this. I like painted concrete. But this is their TV room. Now we get into the mess. This is basically trash, but we have to save the boxes um, to use to store. Oh my God, get ready for this. <laughs> this. Most of everything you see here is baby stuff that has been given to them. And uh, it includes car seats and all kinds of stuff I don't even know what to call it. And uh, clothes and blankets and, 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 and. And then, as we turn around... <laughs> this is what she received at her shower that was on Saturday. Okay, so all of this stuff and all of this stuff needs to find a home in that little kid's room. So, or something, I don't know. This is their um, stroller. Um, and it's also a car seat. Oh, they've come a long way since my day. But, um, you know, all of this stuff has to um, find its way to 
to some place. Now the interesting caveat here is that my daughter, who is um, going to have a baby at the end of August, beginning of September, wants to do it all herself. In my world, this would have all been put away by now. Okay, it's Tuesday, I think, Monday, Tuesday, I don't know. But yeah, in my world, this would have all been put away and we'd be searching for it later. Um, yeah. So that's what I've been doing. Trying to make sense out of chaos. I'll bet you think I'm having a really good time. Well, no. <laughs> no, I'm really not. Um, my daughter and I had our first fight, which we're going to have many. So, And they're not fights, they're just disagreements. Um, yeah, last night. And it was basically because I said, you know, stop tying my hands. You know, you said, come here and help me. And I get that. She's tired. And my feeling is, you know, let's get it done. So that I can go somewhere. <laughs> As I've said many times before, I'm going to be so ready to go when it's time to go. Seriously, I'm going to be so ready to go. And I know that I'm going to have a grandson and he's going to be completely adorable and blah, 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 blah. But April 1st is going to hit. I'm on the road. Oh, let me show you something really pretty. This is a quilt uh, made by my sister. Okay, here it is. Isn't it pretty? I really like it. Anyway, world theme again. And, um, you know, she is a quilter. And, and put this together. It's really quite beautiful. I hope it shows up on video nicely because it is really, really beautiful. And then little pictures of little kids. Um, and all of this is, she made all of this. It, this amazes me. And it amazes me, the people who have this kind of uh, talent. Um, really, really beautiful. And then that's what the underside looks like. Very pretty. Okay. And that's for the new baby boy. Oh, this is funny for those of you who have been watching for a while. Remember when I went to Mexico to get my teeth fixed? Well, I bought that while I was standing in line and uh, or brought it to my daughter's home for the baby. Yeah, it's just funny. Okay. Holy crap. Really? Talk to you later. Be well and be brave. Bye.